scriptures, read the word of God. Genesis 49 and 5. Simeon, I come to you in Jesus' name. My name, Carlton Adolphus Warren. Calm down, calm down, calm, calm, calm down, Bridgetown town. You used to make me smile, but now I frown. It wasn't like this just the other day. Going to try to turn people away. I say, calm down, Bridgetown town. You used to bring me up, you bring me down. It wasn't like this just the other day. Breaking in the car, I believe. That was my first offence, like, you know, like, young man, you, you've killed on money. South London, you don't go to school, you break a car and steal a radio and sell it for a five or something. One thing about him is he reminds me of um, when Public Enemy made one of the greatest hip-hop albums of all time. He says... Brothers and sisters! Brothers and sisters! The man died, he got stabbed. I've never done the incident, but I was guilty by association. So, like, uh, I, I got five years. The guy who done it got life. The others got three years of ball stools, and it was just, like, a bad time. Break up your folly ground. God is a God of love. I, I wanted some jewellery, so we went to rob a jewellery shop, <laughs> you know? But, like... My, my friend pointed the gun at the man. The man fainted. His wife screamed. <laughs> and, like, there was just panic. So, like, everybody ran off. We ran on Stockwell Park Estate, or we drove on Stockwell Park Estate. They surrounded the estate and done door to door. And, like, Stockwell Park is a big estate. So we waited a long time. <laughs> and then, then they, they came and, like, you know, we, we got nicks. I got three years for that. The four says in his heart, there is no God. Vile and corrupted are they. So, this is what I said to myself. You know what? I don't, I don't mind prison. Prison is walk off a duck's back for me. I, it doesn't matter to me. So I just think, like, it's my mum that it grieves me to think she's, she's getting old. She'd be coming up prison to visit me. But, like, one thing I can say that come out of it is, like, my love for her just like grew more because she just stood by me tight. Well, I asked him what he was talking about and he said that basically mend your ways or whatever, whatever, whatever. You know, I can't just like stop my dreams of like getting wealth and that. So I started professional boxing. My first three people, I stopped them. Uh, Michael Watson was my fourth one. He'd stop six, <laughs> right? They live in darkness, they will stumble and not know what they stumble. The fool, the fool, the fool says in his heart, there is no God. Most of the money that I got, I got from sparring. See, like sparring uh, with Alex Blanchard, the European champion, uh, Graziano Rocciani, the world champion. Ignorance is no excuse for pain and be baptized in Jesus' name. Uh, in one sense, it was hard. In the next sense, for me, it was good discipline for life. Because, like, the discipline you learn, you won't ever forget it. And it will always keep you strong. Because me, if I was to react, I would react if I felt well, frightened or challenged. Oh what do you call a man of God? Not a drug dealer. What, so what? He's a cockhead. So don't come and run up your mouth with me. You don't know me. You he's a man of God? You know me? So you, yeah, just, he's a cockhead. How many times have I seen you out here? How many times? You're a juggler. Oh God, you understand? God. You're not a juggler. Listen to me. You're a juggler. Yeah, no. We're in Rome for this. They're just going down. I am an attack. You're a juggler. Go on, juggler. Somebody just came and just passed on. Your mum's ill. Go. She's out of King's College Hospital. Go. Drive down King's College. And I just came in there, you know, with the, the mortuary room. Like, just came in there and I just felt like my mum was still warm. 
home, but she was dead. You are dead, and your eyes are open. You are spiritually dead. After a time, I said, you know what? I've got to get myself out of this depression. So what do I do when I want to get out of depression? A bit of money, a bit of fluff, a bit of drugs, a bit of drink. You think you're living? Got myself some tobacco. See, see my little friend out the road, brought my girl back home, was uh, doing a little thing with her. And then I heard this voice say, is this how you treat me? And I just knew that wasn't my fault. So I just jumped off, boom, boom. And I was just, I was frightened <laughs> more than anything, you know. God is a God of love. I was just there still moping about for days and and then uh, the spirit just came on me, say one day, I'm going to preach. I'm going to preach before, I'm going to preach. But this is what I believe, right? Or this is my belief, what keeps me strong. It's not me. I always have this belief. It's not me that's talking. The spirit must be given voice. So if you're willing to give it voice, it will come to you and do its work through you. Therefore, with loving kindness have I drawn thee. God has given us eternal life. I don't miss where I came from, but each night I dream about being back home. And I wake up in the morning, I'm too tired, I'm tired of being alone. So I get up and go downtown. And pick me out a little piece of ground Where I can prove something to the world I can prove something